Assalamu alaikum guys and welcome back to my channel Today inshallah I'm going to be making some tandoori chicken legs Would you have a look at how delicious these chicken legs look I can tell you now it tasted amazing If you guys have a passion for food and you want to try out some nice easy recipes then please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on the notifications bell Guys, so today inshallah I'm gonna be making some tandoori chicken legs with some masala chips so these are the ingredients that I'm gonna use for the tandoori chicken so just to go through everything I've got a couple of pieces of tandoori I mean sorry I've got a couple of pieces of chicken legs here and some peeled and chopped potatoes now the seasoning that I'm gonna use is this one is paprika one tablespoon this one's tandoori masala that is garam masala here this one here is dried coriander and that's another form of tandoori masala but a lighter version I've got some turmeric ground, got some Cajun seasoning, some chilli powder there, some peri peri seasoning, some lemon dressing and obviously the main part of the whole ingredient is the salt that we need to give it the taste and some olive oil so yes guys these are, this is everything that we're going to use let's get to it I'm going to start with adding in all the masala so I'm going to start by adding in the tandoori masala so add it in then I'm going to add in the paprika and the lighter tandoori masala, I'm going to add this in as well and after the goro masala, so add this in and now the dried coriander ok guys, now it's time to add in some peri peri seasoning and also some chili powder and a bit of Cajun seasoning as well not too much, just a little bit and just a hint of turmeric ground that should be okay some lemon dressing so put in quite a bit of lemon in there and now it's time to add in some salt so add in the salt and then two tablespoons of olive oil so add that in now just mix all of this guys mix it so it's well combined so the marination is then ready so guys add more lemon in there so it becomes more liquidy so we're gonna add a, quite a bit in now it's just time to mix it so just mix it well now Okay guys, now it's time to add in the chicken legs. So add it in and make sure you coat the chicken nicely all over so it's coated nicely. So just move it around in the marination as I'm doing like this now. And then the chicken should be coated and then start on the next one. And there you go and just do the same thing here. Just move it around in the marination and it should get coated. And the parts that are not coated properly, just use your own hand and massage it in. I've got slits in the chicken legs as well, so ensure that you um, massage the uh, marination into the slices. And that's that one done. Now continue the same process until all the chickens have been marinated. You now, guys, the chicken legs have been coated well. Now it's time to add in the potatoes. Alright, so add in the potatoes. And just mix it until the potatoes are well coated onto the marination. Just continue mixing with that. Okay. 
it's been well coated now guys so just leave it in the bowl and we, just, we can apply some cling film to this bowl now and leave it to the side for a couple of hours so the marination settles in and then after a couple of hours or your personal preference if you want to keep it in for 24 hours then you can do um, once after 24 hours or after a couple of hours then we just need to put it in the roaster and yeah let it cook I'm gonna have to add in some foil into the into the roast, into the roaster so I've got the one half Time to add in the other half of foil as well. So once we've added this in, guys, it's just a matter of putting in the chicken. Okay, guys, now it's time to add in the chicken. So just place it out evenly throughout the tray. So now guys it's time to add in the potatoes, so the chopped potatoes, add them in, spread them out throughout the bolster, there we go, that's done, and the remaining of the marination just pour it on on top of the chickens, there we go. There we are guys, now it's a matter of just keeping the lid on and leaving it on slow cook for an hour. So after an hour guys the chicken is ready, Would you just listen to that sizzling sound, satisfying, very satisfying. So guys, after an hour, the chicken should be ready now. So you can check it, poke a fork into the chicken to see if it's been made according to your liking. If it has, then there you have it guys, your chicken dondori legs are ready. So there you have it guys, your chicken tandoori legs are ready. You can serve this with whatever you like. I made masala chips and if you guys want to know how I made masala chips, keep posted for my next video and I'll show that and how I made masala chips. But yeah guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. To subscribe to my channel, click the channel logo to the top left of the screen. If you guys have any suggestions on what I should be cooking next then please leave your suggestions in the comment section below for the full ingredients of this recipe I would leave them in the description box as well so check that out guys and like my content keep posted for my next video coming soon till next time assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh